to use the whole social tutorial for beginners. Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can manage all of your social media brand on your singular platform called Zoho Social. So let's get into it. Now, Zoho Social is a simple management uh, software where you can just manage all of your brand identities on a singular platform. So to get started, you're just gonna go on to zoho.com and what you're just going to do is that you can find different tools and you're just going to click on zoho.com and you can scroll down and find zoho social in their marketing section so you're just going to go on over there and you're just going to go on zoho.com slash social and what you're going to do is you're going to begin by signing up so you can sign up for agencies or for businesses and i'm just going to start up for a business now you can enter your company name and continue with your email address or password or you can also just continue with your Google account. If you have a Google account that you use for most of your business needs, then you can just opt for that as well. So I'm just going to continue with my Google account over here. And I'm just going to sign up with my Google account. So I'm just going to select the Google account. And I'm just going to sign up like so. I'm going to enter my password now once you've entered your password you're going to get a code on your gmail account so i'm just going to open that up and wait for my code and sometimes if you can't find it it might be in your spam mine is right over here so i'm just going to paste it and i'm just going to verify my account now i'm just going to continue with the terms of service and now i'm going to continue my setup process now I'm just gonna click on try Zoho Social now, and now I can begin my Zoho journey. So it's a very simple setup process. You can continue with your Gmail account. What is more easier than that? And even otherwise, you just have to enter your email address and then you can just continue off with your business name and you're gonna be ready to set up your Zoho Social account. So we're just going to wait for a couple of seconds for our Zoho Social dashboard to be loaded. Now, after that, they are just going to ask you what kind of social media objective that you want to do. So I want to do publishing and scheduling, and then you're going to add your company size, and then you're just going to continue with your phone number, and then you're just going to get started by connecting up your brand. So you're going to click on connect to Facebook or whatever social media platform you have. So it might be Twitter, LinkedIn, Instagram, Google My Business, YouTube, or Pinterest. So I'm just going to first off connect with my um, Facebook account. So I'm just going to enter my password over here to set up my Facebook to my uh, Zoho. And I'm just going to continue with my Facebook account. I'm going to continue. And now you can see over here that I have several pages on my Facebook account. So I'm just going to go with uh, the best tips to lose weight. I'm going to add that to my Zoho social account. And just like that, I have added the best tips to lose weight, which is a Facebook page on my Facebook account. And now I can just begin setting it up. So you can see I'm going to click on connect later. And now you can invite people to work on your brand. So if you have any teammates, you can add them over here. I don't have any, so I'm just going to skip for now. And I'm just going to begin with this portfolio. So you can see that this is like the brand that I have selected. And you can add multiple brands and you're going to have different dashboards for each one of them. So don't worry about that. But what you're going to do is on your homepage, you're going to find all the basic stuff. So your recent posts, your basic brand health. So for me, it's like a total zero because it's like a very incomplete page. Now, after that, you have your post section. And from here, you can add posts onto your social media account. So you can have scheduled posts. Like if you have team members working under you, they can like schedule posts and then they can wait for approval. So when you approve the post, then they get posted. If you don't approve them, they don't get posted. Then you have unpublished posts, so any of the posts you reject. You have drafts, calendars as well. And from here, you can just create a post on a certain date and it will be uploaded on that date. So you just have an entire publishing schedule. So let's say tomorrow I want to add five days till book launch and I want to schedule it for tomorrow. And then the day after tomorrow, it would be four days till our brand new exclusive diet book. And then you can also schedule a specific time that you want to post this. So maybe I want this to be 7 p.m. And I want it, yeah, that's around it. 
and I'm just gonna schedule it like so and then you can schedule posts like so on and so forth and then you can also have immediate posts so if you want to post something immediately you can click on publish posts you can click on new posts over here and instead of clicking on schedule a specific date you can just click on publish now and then you can publish any content directly from your zoho social account instead of just going back into your facebook account back into your facebook page and then posting from there you can manage all of your social media needs from here as well now after that you have your messages section so all of your messages that you receive on your facebook page or whatever kind of social media brand that you have connected can be replied from directly from soho social and then you have your monitoring section so from here what you can do is you can just take a look at different dashboards and you can just see like what kind of um, analytics you have you can click on add new column and add like a different kind of category so you have paid search reviews mentions visitor posts so let's say you want to check out your mentions so you can add that over here this is a lot more useful once you have your business up and running then this feature is a lot more useful in that situation currently if your page is totally empty then it's really not that useful because you're not going to have any posts or you're not going to have any mentions for your facebook page now after that you have connections now if people are engaging in your facebook account or facebook page and whatever kind of social media page you have the instagram page or if maybe it fits a pinterest account so then you're going to be able to see most engaged and recently engaged in all connections so all of the people that have interacted with your social media space can be found over here and that is a great feature to use for marketing as well so you can easily find all the people that have interacted with you and then you can just find their emails and then start email marketing them or use other marketing tactics for the emails that you've gathered from your Zoho social account now after that you have your collaborate section so you can collaborate with different people on your team over here and discuss different kinds of posts different kinds of uh, approaches that you want to opt for for your brand what kind of um message you're conveying so all of your teamwork can be done over here and on your left you're going to find these different sections that you can work with on the teamwork section now after that you have your report so this is basically just a very simple data-based report on your facebook page or your brand whatever it might be you can see the likes followers uh, the engagement the um, overall performance of your page or brand and this is just a summary page then on your left you have the audience page where you can monitor specific audience related questions then you have your post and engagement then you have your performance and then you have your reach and impression so you can track all of your performances for your social media brand right on zoho as well and then you have lead forms as well so you can set up facebook lead forms and these are just basically simple surveys or forms that people fill out that can generate you more information which you can further use for better marketing marketing strategies now on your top right you have your team notifications you have basic notifications for yourself you have basic settings for your account you can change the profile picture you can change the like overall social channel information and then if you click on over here you have your basic account settings so that's going to be your own account settings and that is how simple and easy it is to get started with zoho social for your social media platforms i hope you guys found this video helpful and you are now able to to get started with Zoho Social as well. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the YouTube channel and I will catch you guys in the next video.